from your perspective, what do you think are the biggest challenges that have arisen during the course of the war for journalists reporting in Yemen? I mean, it's been incredibly difficult to report on Yemen, but I think you know, particularly for local journalists on the ground that are based in Yemen. Um, because not only are you having to work through airstrikes and shelling and the fighting within the war, but you're also at risk of, you know, annoying one faction of the, you know, parties to the conflict that could end up getting you killed on the ground. And we've seen cases of that on the ground. Um, it's, yeah, it's become very, very difficult for them to work there. Do you think the future holds for journalists reporting in Yemen uh, and for the country as a whole? Can you see any improvements on the horizon? From my experience, I think for journalists it's only gotten harder to work in Yemen. You know, you're um, very limited in the reporting that you can do because of the coalition not allowing journalists um, into the country. And then it's very hard to work once you're in the country because you are constantly being watched by minders from the different sides. Um, they're constantly trying to control what you're reporting on. Um, and, you know, it's, it works in parallel with the situation in the country. Over the last couple of years, we've seen it deteriorate drastically. And there hasn't been any effort to resolve the situation in any way, neither diplomatically or militarily. Um, so I can only, you know, from what I see, the situation is only going to get worse unless um, the international community puts pressure on, on the warring factions to reach some kind of diplomatic solution because there's no way either side is going to win militarily.